What's your call? All right, guys, welcome back to my channel. This is my sister Kenny Taylor, right Taylor, here. Taylor, Taylor. <laughs> I move, it's raining. Stop playing. I'm gonna keep that in there too. No, you better not. Right, well, you gonna be quiet? First of all, tell out, can take down your Kennedy, video. you gonna be quiet? I, I, my face is in there and I don't want it in there. All right, guys, welcome rights. back to my channel. Today is um, August 13th, move in day. It's about 9 20 and it is currently raining outside. Um, I already moved a couple of bigger pieces um, into the car. I still have to um, pack up my clothes. I'm trying to get done by at least 9.30 so I have time to straighten up and get ready. But yeah, that's what we're doing. My sister up here got an attitude, but that's okay. You know, had to embarrass her a little bit, you know. Don't play. Show her. Show yeah. my arms? No, keep you in your place. Show you. Tell me, please. <clears throat> it's help you out. No. Yes. But anyway, it's moving day. And I'm about to go to school. I'm excited. Let me tear you up. Um, my move in time is at 3 o'clock, so we're going to leave like around 12, 1230. So make sure we get there on time. But yeah. If you like this video, please continue watching and like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, as of right now, this is what my room is looking like. I cleared out of a lot of stuff, um, took all the pictures off the wall. I still have to um, take those items on the couch over there to the car, but those are smaller pieces, so I'm just trying to wait on that. And then next, I'm going to be bagging all of my clothes and shoes up. I'm just going to speed through this process because it's probably going to take me a good 10 to 20 minutes. But yeah, this is what I'm doing right now. almost got everything in there i'm trying to make sure i leave room so that, that um my mom can still see out the back while she's driving so i just put some stuff on the seats um, we were going to take my little sister if it was room but we won't be able to now because it's just entirely too much stuff but yo yo you're gonna be hitting the road in a couple or like an hour and a half or something like that but this is what it's all looking like okay guys so it is the next day um i didn't get to vlog much yesterday because we were really tired um we had just moved my sister in the day before and we had to go grocery shopping all this stuff so it was just kind of a lot um i didn't get it finished um organizing until this morning because i was trying to update my phone as y'all can see a girl has moved over to the iphone game whatever y'all call it whatever but yeah i had to transfer all my data and it took like a long time i ended up falling asleep so i just woke up this morning and got everything situated because my roommate is still out here and i know she was going to be coming and moving in today 
but I believe she's not so yeah without all the blabbering. Let's get into showing y'all what this room looks like. pretty much used all the same well not all the same but most of the same items I did from my um, dorm room last year I got rid of a lot of pink um, this is kind of like the original color scheme I wanted to go with at first but it was just kind of hard finding like those cream colors or whatever because you know it was pretty expensive but yeah I guess we can start over here um, this is all the same things I have from last year, just my little wicker bin, calendar, light. And then I have my desk over here, just kind of decorated it with like some black, white, and gold accessories. And I just brought that little blanket from home to tie in like the tan colors, the nude and tan colors. And then right here, like usually my hats would be on Yasmin, which is the mannequin. Her name is Yasmin Dior. But um, this time I wanted to create like a hat wall. I had saw this on Instagram, well, not Instagram, but YouTube. And I found this on Amazon. I'll link it down below. It's originally like for pictures, but I was like, that'll be nice and it's not too big. And I only had three hats. So I was like, it was the perfect size for me to put that on there. And it looks so cute. But yeah, um, I got this mannequin doll from Hobby Lobby last year and just the same bag that I had to go with it and just put my little purse on the side of it. And then I have my bedding, which I had from last year as well. And then up here, I got these um, three pictures, like the little um, line art pictures off of Amazon. I'll also link those, link those down below. And I got these eucalyptus um, vines i don't even know i don't know what type of plant it is but i'll link it down below i got it from amazon as well and then i just have my picture that i also had from last semester um and yeah the only thing is like when i was kind of like buying my new um pieces of like decor to go for my room i forgot about my rug which does not really correlate with everything or coordinate with everything so I'm gonna be getting a new rug. Um, I'm trying to describe it. It's like a cream rug and has like the little geometric um, black lines on it. I'm pretty sure y'all know what I'm talking about, but I'll um, include a picture of it or insert a picture of it. And then this year I am in a different dorm, but it's pretty much the same setup, but um, the windows are different. So we each have our separate windows and I just have my little decor on my windowsill over here just a little plant i had from last year some um perfume bottles and a broken clock which you know anything works and then right here i have my clock my lamp my um keep my little jewelry in that little pandora bag and then i have my two little purses mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But yeah, I really like it. I wish, I really wish I would have thought about the rug before I got here because I mean, it's fine, but let me step back so y'all can see the whole look of it. The gray is pretty much kind of throwing it off. I mean, it still looks nice, but I would prefer the cream rug with the cream and black geometrical rug. And then this is my closet. Um, also, I would have thought about like all of the clothes that I was bringing because I did bring pretty much all of my clothing. I didn't really think about um, like what clothes I usually wear, what I don't. I was just trying to hurry up and pack and I just grabbed everything. I wish I kind of hadn't done that because it's like really tight in there and jam packed. But it's still a pretty good nice size closet. Don't be like me and do what I did. But um and then I just have like my little purse hanging here. And then up at the top, usually you can put like your TV or whatever, but I just use my laptop and watch Netflix. But I just kind of like 
decorate a little bit up there. That was kind of like one of my favorite pairs of heels that I've gotten. And then just a little Aldo box with like a bean bag up there, just for a little decor. And then the bathroom is pretty much the same. I didn't do much. I still am still in the process of cleaning it, but I just wanted to go ahead and film the rest of this because I have to edit it and put it up on my YouTube channel. But yeah, pretty much the same thing as last um, year. If you want to see what it like fully looked like, you can go um, watch my watch last year's, I guess, like room tour or whatever. You can see what this bathroom looked like, but it won't be any more pink in it. So yeah, I might end up redecorating this as well or adding like new pieces in different colors, but you know, I don't know. But yeah, if you enjoyed this um, move-in vlog and you want to see more vlogs, especially since I have a new phone, I have better camera um, camera quality. So if y'all want to see like um, first day vlog or getting ready, please let me know down in the comments below. But if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for watching.